Cloud computing has opened up an entirely new world of connectedness in applications. This has led to more and more APIs driving various parts of software systems. Understanding how these APIs work and ensuring that business needs is crucial for many organizations has led to a great need for API testing. In this course, API Testing with Postman, We'll look at how you can use an API testing tool, Postman, to help explore, understand, and test APIs. Postman is an easy to use and understand API testing tool. It's a desktop application that comes with a lot of useful features for both exploring and automating APIs. I'm Dave Westerveld, and we have a lot to cover in this course. I've been working as a tester for well over 10 years now. I find API testing to be fascinating and interesting and I'm glad to be able to teach you some of what I know about the powerful API testing tool Postman. In this course, we'll cover various features of Postman. In the first section, we'll look at some of the basics of APIs, how they work, and how we can go about testing them with Postman. Next, in section two, we'll get started with some hands-on API testing. We'll look at some testing challenges and learn how to use Postman for testing API get calls. Then, in section three, We'll look at how to use Postman to test API calls that change data. We'll look at post, put, and delete calls, and we'll once again learn how to test these by using hands-on challenges. Following that, in Section 4, we'll look at how to set up API test automation using Postman. We'll look at how to structure tests using Postman collections, as well as how to set up validations. We'll look at how you can share data between tests and consider how to use mocking and how to run your tests from the command line. Then, in Section 5, we'll look at how you can use Postman to help with building quality APIs. We'll look at topics like debugging and monitoring APIs, as well as how to quickly and easily build API documentation. Finally, in Section 6, we'll look at some advanced techniques you can use in Postman. We'll look at using it for data-driven testing. We'll also see how you can capture API requests and how to import data directly into Postman from other sources. We'll also look at how to use TV4 libraries to validate the schema of an API. This course is designed to be accessible for beginners. You do not need to know much at all about APIs to get started. You'll learn about the various aspects of APIs and how they work as we learn together how to use Postman. I really believe that the best way to learn something is by trying it out. And so this course is intensely practical and uses real life examples from public APIs that you can try your hand at. All you need is an open mind and a willingness to learn. So let's get started.